Hello Capricorn, let's see what's going on for you for March 2024. Let's see what's happening. If you haven't noticed, I have brought back not just the monthlies, but the dailies. All right, so make sure you're checking all of that out. Let's get your story here. We're starting off with Knight of Michael. Four of Michael, okay. You overdid yourself. You overdid yourself. Got a little too ambitious. This is mental exhaustion here. Where maybe you went into the fight, you're charging ahead, and then you're like, okay, maybe maybe I didn't think this through entirely. Maybe I need to chill out. Maybe I need to reconsider. There's a little bit of that too. All right, we have the three of Gabriel here. A leap of faith. All right. King of Raphael. I'm telling you, make sure you're watching for your sun, moon, your rising, and maybe even watch for your uh, Venus sign as well. If you don't know what any of that is, need your birth time, you can look it up, get your natal chart online. Most sites have them for free, so you can go look that up. <sighs> there, I'm telling you, you'll see all these overlapping messages, but for you specifically, there's this feeling of, as I hit my hand into the desk, um, there's a feeling of I'm tired of being alone. I'm tired of um, doing the same old work. I'm ready for a new challenge. I'm ready for some growth. The thing that's giving me pause here, where I'm not pause in a bad way, but kind of pause like, well, well, what's going on here? Three of Gabriel, King of Raphael, Leap of Faith. There could be, if you're single, there could be someone coming in. I'm going to flat out tell you, with, with an offer of love. With an offer of love. They might be coming on a little strong, okay? The energy they have is a little um, quick. <laughs> like, so, you know, we'll have to see what that is. If you want a personal reading where we look directly at your specific situation, you can book that at angelsouls444.com. You fill out a form. I record the reading. I send it to you. That's what you're booking through the site. If you want a live one-on-one -on -one reading over Zoom, please make sure you are respecting the time limit. Make sure you know what you signed up for, okay? Then you can email me. Or if you want a live course, connecting with angels, angel mediumship, or how to read angel cards, email me at angelsouls444 at gmail.com and see if there is any availability. I'm not doing those too much these days, okay? But maybe there's a spot here and there. Doesn't hurt to ask. Okay. There's just been, like, I, I'm hearing a long time coming. And again, that's a repeating message that's been going on for a lot of the signs. Three of Gabriel. Let's just start with reading the cards. It says, prosperity arising from wise planning. Time to take the next step. Optimistic plans that turn out as expected. For you, there is heavy foreigner energy. So foreign to you. So say you're in Australia, I would be the foreigner to you. Um, or I'm an American, maybe I work with somebody in China. I don't know, like something's going on there. Or there's some opportunity that comes from someone. This is the someone, okay? <laughs> right here, I haven't just, I just haven't held it up yet. From somebody who might be from somewhere else, okay? Um, or a company or something that might be elsewhere. So that's part of it. And this is something that comes in pretty quickly. So the Knight of Michael says, strong, committed, intellectual, diligent. Time to move quickly. Choose logic over emotion. Sudden changes. See, that's why this feels like <laughs> it's almost, I mean, it's kind of funny. I'm laughing because there's this giant um, sail, this what, sailboat, sail, it's a ship, but with all these sails on it. Like I would imagine that doesn't just, roll up on you um and yet that's what it feels like it's like hi we're here hey it's here you know grab your bag and it might literally be for some of you like hey grab your bag we're going to europe or if you're in europe we're going to india i don't know like it's it has this immediacy about it I'm hearing golden opportunity, but it feels more like a golden opportunity um, that has to do with something that you're not familiar with. So that would might be 
goes back to that theme of a foreign culture, um, foreign to you. And that's not, okay, oh, okay, so this may not just be um, by a foreign person and let, let's say like a love connection, you know, getting your hot lover <laughs> who doesn't speak your language and maybe you think that, I mean, okay, listen, hey, yo, you can make anything happen, but this might not just be job or love or going somewhere to get health addressed or whatever. This has to do with, remember, you don't actually have to be getting on a plane and going somewhere for these things to hold true. It could be, let's say, a belief system, okay? And you might learn that, hey, in this region of the world, they believe X, Y, and Z. And something about that really hits home for you. It really expands your awareness, your consciousness. It really makes you refocus. There could be some opportunity like that coming in. But it has this like lightning fast feel about it. Now, let's talk about this king here. This king of Raphael, warm, generous, honorable, refined. Yes, it is safe to trust the ability to accomplish many things at once. Follow your creative passions. So this could be sudden movement facilitated by this very kind, very experienced person, okay? This person may have seen you struggling. Again, that's been a repeating message <laughs> as well. Might have seen you struggling and saying, hey, I can help. Or more than anything for a lot of you, this this is someone who really cares about you. Now, that does not have to be in a romantic way, okay? I worked for a finance company where my boss treated me like his daughter, right? I've had other jobs where I was treated like their little sister, uh, so they cared and they wanted to see me succeed and, you know, I made sure that their, their life was in order because I was their assistant. I made sure that, um, you know, I showed them caring and concern to make sure that I anticipated all their needs to make sure they weren't stressed about something. You know what I mean? So there was like that kind of exchange, but it wasn't anything romantic. It, ugh, no, <laughs> no, it wasn't. Okay. I promise you <laughs> not on either side. I promise you. Okay. But anyway, this King of Raphael is someone who sort of is standing up for you. Um, I just got the feeling it might be standing up against, if this is a separate person, if someone's trying to rush you into something, someone else comes in and says, no, no, that opportunity is not going to go, go away. Um, we can work this out. This could also be somebody who's like, hey, I've got the deal of the century. You have to decide right now to uproot your entire life and move in a different direction. Build something new with us. And this might be the person who has the real power who says, no, there was no rush. Okay. We will get this worked out. This is somebody very kind and understanding. Very kind and understanding. And yet, here's this four of Michael. So the four of Michael is saying take a take a beat with this take a minute with this insights that come from quiet meditation the need for more sleep or time off seek relief from stress because a lot of the stuff that's happening for you here in March is on the tail end of a lot of other things crumbling down or a lot of other things getting in the way obstacles you know all those kinds of things that a lot of people are working on right now so you can take a rest before you make a decision. Now, if this is a love partner coming in, some of, again, you would only, you could only really know through a personal reading, but this could be somebody who's from somewhere else, again, who just overdoes it and kind of comes in too quickly, comes on too strong. Um, be careful of love bombing. We want to, we want to be mindful of that. I don't know. For some of you, I just feel like someone comes in and they're just enamored with you. Like, they're just like, oh my gosh, you're just the coolest person ever. Um, you're just so smart. You're just, <laughs> it's, it's kind of cute actually. But this king, he has power. And I'm hearing it's almost like this unlikely partner or it's an unlikely combo. So maybe you do have somebody who is really caring, nurturing. They never lost their empathy and yet they still manage to have power. Right, they they manage to be a leader in a strong leader kind of way, but they're also very empathetic. They've never lost that part of them. Okay, here's the decision I think you're up against here. 
do I start over? Do I zero out my entire life and take this leap of faith and, and move towards this opportunity over here? Okay. So Archangel Metatron. So Metatron helps you with intuition. You're definitely going to need to lean on your intuition about whatever this decision is. Okay. Believe in yourself. Listen to your heart. Do what gives you joy. So this is going in a whole new direction. Now, part of what might be coming up, I, your whole reading is strong on the what's happening somewhere else or, you know, what someone else's culture is. Hmm. I'm just, I'm just listening. Some of you, there might be, I've rested up. Now I'm going to take this leap of faith and I'm going to travel towards a situation. Now this is for a very small percentage of you. You're traveling towards a situation and they're saying not recommended, not recommended. I'm thinking of the example of the Lahaina fires, you know, everybody's like, Oh, I'm going to go there. I'm supposed to go on vacation there. And you know, I'm going to go there anyway and I'll help out. But no, like the, you're going to be in the way. You're taking up resources. You see what I'm saying? So some of you are thinking in those terms or it would just be flat out dangerous for you to be there. So I don't know who you are out there thinking that. Rethink it. Okay. Rethink it. You can support in other ways. But the bigger message here let's just break this down the bigger energy is around someone coming forward and showing you a lot of care and support does not have to be romantic but a lot of care and support someone believes in you okay the other sort of secondary energy would be someone coming forward with say a job opportunity or a volunteering or travel opportunity be careful with that especially if you don't know them okay if you do not know them do not go down that road okay just Please be careful, okay? Um, but this is someone saying, oh, you'll get the hang of it. Or, oh, yeah, um, if you're going to take a remote job with us, we're on the other side of the world. So, yeah, you're going to be basically on third shift. You're going to have to work in the middle of the night. Right? <laughs> there's something there that needs some strong consideration. And then there's that third group of people. And this is the lighter, the, the, like, um, the message isn't as strong around this, but... There are some people out there who think they're going to do good by going to a place that's struggling. And I mean, I'm flat out hearing you're not wanted there. You're not wanted there for good reason. So don't. Okay. Nor would it be very safe for you. So I know a lot of things all rolled up into one. Angelsouls444.com. If you would like a reading, we will leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.